Hello guys, I am here at Foreign Trade University, one of the most famous university in Hanoi and in Vietnam as well. Today, I will lead you to discover this school with one of my special guests. And can you guess who she is? And she is... Hello guys, my name is Ling and I'm a third year student at Foreign Trade University and today I will show you around my school and, and let's go! go. Building A, and when you come to my school, one of the impressive thing you should visit is Building A, the highest building in my school. Wow, it's so modern. So, yeah. how high is it? It has a tail floor for studying, and there has some office of department in school. Mm. So, do you usually study in this building? Yes, of course. Um, and the, this building has an interesting thing, that is elevator. Mm. Yeah. And if you want to use the elevator, you have to stand in line to get in. And this is the typical traditional in, of the student in my school. just visited building A, which was built with modern style, and so now we are at building B, which were combined with a modern and traditional style. This area is for students to practice dancing. They are always gathered here every evening. Okay, so really? So I guess um, the FTU in the evening is really bustling, right? Yes, that's right. Uh, so many p people say that the FTU students are very dynamic, so can you tell me why? Oh, because FTU is a good environment for students to develop themselves with many clubs. And you know, there are more than 40 clubs, such as dancing, guitar or singing, a lot of clubs. Wow, 40 clubs. Yeah. 40 clubs really really good environment for students to practice skill, right? Okay, so as we can see, the students in your school are very dynamic and talented. And also, there are many clubs here, so how about you? Uh, do you usually study under pressure? Yes, sure. Uh, you know, Foreign Trade University is on the top of universities in Vietnam, uh, so we have a lot of things to study. And it's very difficult to balance between studying and personal development. Uh, and, and especially in this final exam, I have to study, uh, I have to study uh, so much and sometimes I feel tired. Oh, yeah, that's right. So studying in university is not easy. And so I see your English is very, very good, especially speaking skills. So can you tell me your journey to master English? Yes, my journey to master English is very difficult. Now, when I was in high school, and it was bad. And uh, we just focus on grammar and reading skill. And <clears throat> when I started to learning at the at the university, I uh, started to find the method to improve my English skill. <clears throat> and one day, my friend introduced me to I start English center, and I'm very impressed with uh, uh, impressed about the method of teachers and the intel the uh, intel the isms of 
teaching assistant, and I began to conquer my English skill. Okay, cool. And how do you spend time to uh, practice English at home? Yeah, I spend uh, I spend more than one hours a day. Um, I practice English every day. Yes, and I speaking with by myself and in front of in front of the mirror. Yeah. Okay, so it's such a very impressive uh, method to practice with yourself. And so can you give us uh, some advices uh, in learning English? Yeah, I think you must be patient, starting hard, and do it as a habit. Practice English as a habit. Yeah, and I believe that you can improve your English skill and uh, can speaking English well. Okay, cool. Thank you. Thank you a lot for uh, useful advices. And okay, guys, so today we uh, have the special guest here, Miss Ling. And with the talk with her, we have a lot of information about your her English journey, especially she showed us around her school. And just follow us in the next video. We are going to lead you to another uh, university. And thank you so much for watching this video. And goodbye.